Well, I'm gonna go pond fishing again. I just got here walking along this trail. I think I'm gonna try out some top water, maybe a frog, buzz bait. And if those don't work, I'll probably just put on a little swim bait, but we'll see how it goes. Pretty cool out right now. I'm not really sure what the high is for today, but I think it's gonna be pretty good weather. So here's a pond. I'm gonna fish it with my frog first and see if anything will bite. just had a bite. Wow. I think I'm gonna, oh that's so cool. I think I'm gonna put a little popper on this pole since I know they're biting top water. So since I had a bite with my frog I'm gonna try this little popper because maybe they're little fish that can't really eat the frog. There's definitely something over there. It keeps on moving. Oh, there's one. <laughs> Just a little guy. All right. First little guy of the day. There we go. Wow, this guy has a little, little battle scar on him. So that it goes back and gets big. Here he goes. Always fun catching fish on top water. Oh wow, that looks like a decent fish. <laughs> Thing attacked the popper so good. Uh oh, got a little muddy, I'm gonna throw him back there. There we go. Wow, that's really cool. Wow, look at the way he ate that too. Wanted that popper. Second fish of the day. Just another little guy, but a little better. I'm gonna release him back. Gentle toss. And there he goes. Oh. <laughs> he went the wrong way. Oh no, I gotta push him out. Poor little guy. Come on. Get out of the mud. There you go. Okay, so the popper is proving to do really well, so I think I'll use it more. There's one. A little bit in the weeds over there, but I'm pulling them out. Another little guy, but I could catch these all day. It's really fun. Grab him by the mouth. Don't want to mess up the little slime coat too much. There we go. Another little guy. Put him back. It is so muddy and shallow right here. Ooh. 
Whoa, I just got water all over my face. <laughs> That's some nasty water to get in your mouth. Oh no, I see a little spot on the camera lens. I hope that hasn't messed up the footage for today. I hope that's better now. Hopefully I didn't ruin the video. Oh, whoa! That's sad. Wow, that's cool. Big bass skeleton, wow. I've never seen that before. The bite kind of died, so we're gonna come back tomorrow morning and see if it's any better. Okay guys, I'm back at the pond. This is the next day now. As usual, I'm gonna be starting off with the buzz bait. Try to get that top water bite. Thank you to everyone who takes the time to watch my videos. I really appreciate it. Oh, there's one. Oh, nice. Not a huge one, but it's still really fun. Wow, we're barely putting up a fight. It's coming right in. Pull him over. Oh, <laughs> cool. All right. Very nice. Splash water all over my face. <laughs> Just a little guy. Super happy he decided to bite today. All right. Got my picture. Throw him back now. Gotta be as gentle as possible. There he goes. Today has probably been the most um, cool day I've seen in weeks. So I thought maybe that would make the fishing a little better. I plan to sometime go back to that other pond shown earlier in this video and try the buzz bait there, but I didn't have it with me, so that'll have to be for another time. Wow. Oh, wow. The fish are scaring the bait fish onto the shore and they're all jumping around over there. Probably attacking some bluegill. Gotta go try and get that fish. I'll try not to spook whatever fish that was. Just coming up here really slowly. Oh, I just fell on my butt. <laughs> Steep. Oh wow, there it is. Don't know if the camera can see all those ripples. Oh, there's a fish. Maybe it's a little bit, oh yeah, I think that one's better than the other one. Oh! <laughs> wow, this is a jump of fish. This one's definitely nicer. Just gotta make sure to avoid the weeds. Pull them up. <gasps> yeah! Super cool. Wow. That's really, really nice. All right. Really hooked good too. 
I might need my pliers for this one. Okay, there we go. I'm gonna wait on this one. I'd say two pounds, maybe? Guess we're about to see. I use this clamp when weighing my fish usually because I don't want to hurt them and I don't want them to come off the, the scale. This one holds them by their lip. The clamp itself weighs about an ounce, so for whatever I weigh, I usually just take off an ounce. Alright, let's see. Oh, it's a pretty nice fish. 2.48. Wow. <laughs> wow, look at that. Time to release this nice fish. 2.5 pounds. What a nice fight. Oh, gotta throw him out there. All right. So that fish <clears throat> kind of destroyed the swim bait here, tore it all the way through. I don't know if you could see that. So I'm gonna have to put a new one on. And for anyone that might be wanting to know what that looks like, you could watch. So I get some of these Rage Swimmers by Strike King, 4.75. Now what I do is optional, but since there's this part on top, it doesn't really fit good on here, in my opinion. So what I do is I get some scissors, but for now all I have are these right here. I just get those and just kind of cut at it. So there we go. Now the whole top part there is gone. So now that that part's done and you have your swim bait, just do your best to thread it on there, right down the middle. I sometimes mess this part up a lot, no matter how many times I do it. You want it to be as straight as possible. And then just push it up there as best as you can. So now I have something like this. I can usually get it to cover up here, but it, it's really okay. So there you go. That's all you need. Oh, there's one. Oh man, got off. Bit the tail. Must have been a little guy. move over our spots again. I'm gonna switch baits now and put on a popper. There we go. This one. The 
another little fish. There he is. There we go. Put a clamp on there so I can unhook him. Wow, this fish ate it the second it hit the water. All the travels got him too. All right, time to release this one. Oh, oh, dang it. Oh, wow, they just chased it in. Not sure if the GoPro saw that, but it was kind of cool. Here's another one. Wow, Popper's doing great tonight. Here we go, decent little guy. Okay, time to release him. Oh, I just had a bite. Wow, see the ripple I just made? I'm fishing in like an inch of water over there. But I know there's a big fish that just hangs out over here. There's one. <laughs> All right, I'm going to throw him back now. Today's been really, really nice. I've caught a lot of fish on poppers and buzzbaits. 
It's been a nice cooler day out, no wind. The bite's just been really, really nice. If I was talking a bit quieter in the past 30 minutes or so, it's because uh, quite a few people were fishing around me and I didn't really want to speak too loudly. They get kind of shy. Oh! Oh wow, I just had one. I didn't even see anything happen. It must have just bitten the hooks from beneath. I'll end the day off using my buzz bait again. I got one. Wow. <laughs> Good little fish. Had a super good bite over there. Well, the bite sure does get good at this time, but the GoPro can probably hardly see anything. 